Could you please introduce yourself? This is Lauri from the Rasmus. How are you doing, Lauri? I'm doing fucking fine. Oops. Oh, good. I'm, I'm sorry. Hey, um, you have a new record out. Um, it's, it's called Hide from the Sun. It sounds really clear and, and new and fresh. Well, I think so too. And it's been nice to be playing these songs live now for the first time. Uh, we just started the tour uh, like three days ago. We, we started from, um, from Hamburg, Germany, and now... This is, I think, uh, the fourth right. show on this tour. We play here in Amsterdam. And uh, we're going to go keep on touring till the mid-December. So it's quite a long tour. Uh, I think probably after that you're going to tour more. But uh, that will be later. Hey, but I just read on the internet um, about the first gig you did in, um, in, in Hamburg. That was wild and it was intimate, wasn't it? It was really good. You, you put on the website a, a thing. Sort of text. Did you like it? First one. Yeah, it was really place, a uh, really nice place. The the audience could kind of um, be kind of around the stage. So it was really like being on the stage felt like there's people coming from every side. And yeah. It was yeah. really unique place, and uh, everybody could see to the stage. So it was a bit like a auditorium kind of thing. All right. And um, that was the first show of the tour, so everybody was like super excited. Also, also about playing the new songs, isn't it? Yeah, I think you do some tryouts already in Finland. Uh, we did a couple of shows in Finland, but that's that's a different case because in Finland we have been around for eleven years. All right. So, so they we, know you already. yeah, they know all the six albums basically, mm. and I think the rest of the world maybe just know you know Dead Letters exactly. the, in the Shadows album yeah. plus this new one a little bit so in Finland we play also a lot of old songs you've been you've been around so for more than 11 years already in Finland and then how did it all start did it just start with Dead Letters that album in the Shadows that song because it was everywhere well I, outside of Finland it started with uh, in the Shadows basically mm -hmm. that song went to the radios and uh, we did a couple of uh, support tours with um, a Finnish band called Him, for example, and yeah. some other support tours. So just basically... Um, it started growing. Yeah, it started growing, but quite rapidly, I have to say, because of the, it was such a big radio hit. Yeah. So, uh, yeah. so we, could, we had a chance to go to all these cities to play for the first time. And That's weird, after 11 years playing in your own country, and then all of a sudden you got the chance to play with big bands, and now... Now you've sold millions of records, isn't it? From dead letters already. Yeah, um, it's you know some numbers from from which what, what you sold. It's like one point five million, which is incredible. <laughs> That's like, not bad. That's really not bad. It's not bad at all. Um, but it's uh, the first eight years basically we we're just um, playing and touring in Finland, mm. and that was really good because we started not off budget. so young and you know being just fifteen, sixteen years old, and uh, kind of. Trying our limits a little bit, of course, you know, getting all of a sudden getting a lot of free drinks and yeah. girls and, you know, everything. <laughs> so, like, totally lost our minds for a couple of years. And it was good because it was just Finland and it's a small country and it was sort of um, easy to handle anyway. And then now, and now it's out of hand because yeah, I saw just in the, in, in the entrance of the Milky Way, I think hundreds of girls waiting and screaming already now. Well, now it's a bit more out of hand. <laughs> So can you keep keep up yourself, like uh, focusing on the music instead well, of on the girls? Well, you have to do kind of um, not really compromises, but like I just decided not to take any alcohol on this tour. All right. Because I have to <laughs> confess that I think we all are a bit pretty much like on-off guys. You know, it's everything or, or nothing. <laughs> so it's it's I feel good. You know, this is um, sober tour. I have. I will have more memories of this time. All right, last time was a bit... Yeah, I just saw here all these beer. Oh, it's a malt art, it's not alcohol in it. So you asked for a no, non-alcoholic beer. Yeah, well, actually, we didn't, but they brought us. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> but I stick to this uh, ginger beer. It, it, it's no alcohol in it, or is it? Cause yeah. I, no, all right. It's, it's pretty good. Yeah. In that. Cool, cool, really cool. Hey, first sing single here is called No Fear. Um, what's that song about? It's a lovely song. That song is about... Um, kind of about uh, rebirth like starting a new life some people think that it's about death and it's about suicide but it's not really about that it's more like going through this sort of a mental death right. and starting a new life and sort of clearing the table and leaving the bad stuff behind so no fear just going on yeah pretty much like uh, i think it's more like a positive 
um, image like whatever comes to you on your way, just Go for don't it. mind. Yeah, good, good. Hey, but I, I was, I was um, reading these these titles, and it, it seems a bit sometimes a bit down lyrics, not lyrics, but more like titles. Was that the, was that the idea behind the record? Well, this is pretty. We see here immortal. It's not really, but keep your heart broken. You know, that's all misery. It seems a bit like down, but is it is that where you uh, get your inspiration from? For me, it's easier to write about the the down side, side of yeah. life yeah. somehow. And uh, I think in the beginning, our music was more happier. It was also musically different. It was more like based on funk and skate punk. All right. But this is more like uh, the Rasmus sound nowadays, a bit more like um, melancholic melodies and somehow the lyrics turn out to be that also but yeah. i have to say i'm not the most depressed ca- guy you know? <laughs> no, I, s- I didn't I think know. so because you're yeah, really happy. somehow it just feels like these are the th- things that f- i feel good singing about you good. know yeah. i kind of get them out from my body and from my mind when i wrote, write them down when i'm singing about these feelings what's your best time uh, of writing lyrics time of the day um, there is no best time, really. It's, it could be really romantic thing, like being on the tour bus in the candlelight and watching the road, and you know. Mm-hmm. But it also could be in the toilet or yeah. taking a shit. <laughs> <laughs> so you never know. That's a good one. <laughs> cool. What's your favorite song on this uh, new record? Um, my right favorite now, song. Because it must be different every day. I, I kind of like this song called Immortal. That was one of the songs that started off as a jam in the in the sound check, and everybody was kind of um, doing something to this song, so it was really much like um, a spontaneous yeah. thing, and um, that's also kind of one of the the heaviest or rockiest song on the album. Cool. You're gonna play it tonight. We're gonna play it tonight, of course. Cool, cool. All right, let me have a look. Uh, how, how's it been going in, in in Finland? Because the album came out there first, probably. And uh, how's it been on the radio there? Finland has been good. We have a huge following in Finland. And I'm proud of you now there. Yeah, I think yeah. people are quite proud. Yeah. Of course, some people don't like us at all. Whatever. You know, but you know, I, I think we've always been that kind of band that some people love us and some people hate us. Yeah. yeah. And. Um, that's just something to realize. You know. Yeah, but okay, but as long as you have so many fans standing there in front of the door waiting for you, that's no problem then. Yeah, I'm, I'm really happy. We had a really good tour in Finland. We started from Finland, played six shows, and all the places sold out, and the album is already platinum in Finland, and Damn. it's really, really good. All right, cool. Let me have a look. Um, new single, what's going to be? Uh, the next single will be a song called Sail Away. And we just shot a video for this one in Riga, which was a really beautiful place. We played Riga, there a couple of times. Uh, it's Latvia, Latvia. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. 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 And uh, that was really a special location. We shot the video on the beach, and it's a strange beach because um, uh, the water is really looks really cold, like you know, very icy. Uh-huh. And then again, the beach is just pure white sand, and the forest. It's just like pine trees, All so right. it's really a weird combination. Like it looks colors, like, uh, yeah. like it's very northern, but it's somehow like Spain or something. You know, exotic, it's bit, very yeah. exotic. Yeah. That's weird. Yeah, yeah. So that that's gonna be a nice video. So um, you have shot the video already? Yeah. Okay. When? Before the album came out? Oh uh, no! It was like three, four weeks ago. All right. Cool. Where can we see it? I think it's should be out just very soon. Very soon, like this week or so. Yeah. Hey, what about the fans? Uh, do you involve yourself in, in, with the friends? Uh, fans, like when you, when you uh, have finished your concert, do you go to them and have shake hands or whatever, like this meet and greet we just had? Yeah, I mean, there's people been uh, waiting outside, like when we arrived this morning, like 10 o'clock. They were there already. They were already people waiting for us, and it's nice to meet them and, you know, shake hands, take pictures and... Mm-hmm. And stuff and it's nice to get some local gifts you know okay what did you get uh i think f- i've got some like uh, waffles yeah and, <laughs> and some uh, what's the li- weirdest thing you got licorice yeah. and stuff all right um also for some reason from here in amsterdam we've got a lot of uh panties for some reason the underwear stuff cool yeah thrown on stage yeah and also given Right. Like so here, then you go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> please take my pants. <laughs> like, 
Okay. <laughs> and we actually we have a quite collection. nice collection, yes. Right, cool. You have it with you, don't you? Of course. Oh. <laughs> when are you coming back? Um, we might come back next year. Thank you very much and good luck for tonight. Thank you very much. <laughs>